Hello everyone. I am Balaji Rao. Welcome to BR Max class. If you like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to my YouTube channel to get more updates. Fourth property in inverse trigonometric functions chapter. What is this property? Sin of sin inverse x equal to x when x belongs to closed interval minus 1 comma 1. In third property, what we learn? In third property, we learn that sin inverse of sin theta equal to theta. This is what we learn in third property. And this property and the fourth property are different. You observe this fourth property sin of sin inverse x. Here in this third property what we learn sin inverse of sin theta equal to theta. So there is a difference between third property and fourth property. Cos of cos inverse x equal to x. Tan of tan inverse x equal to x. Similarly remaining three. Remember sin of sin inverse x equal to x. This formula holds good only when x belongs to closed interval minus 1 comma 1. So I want to prove the first one here. I'll prove it. To prove sin of sin inverse x equals to x, I'll take sin inverse x equals to theta. Let sin inverse x equals to theta. From the definition of inverse sin function, what is x from this? What is x? x is equals to sin theta. This we learn from the definition of inverse sin function. If sin inverse x equals to theta, x equals to sin theta. You observe here x is equals to sin of what is theta? You observe the first step. What is theta? Theta is sin inverse x. So in place of theta, you write sin inverse x. You observe what we got we got that sin of sin inverse x equals to x. Please observe this result. What we proved? We proved that sin of sin inverse x equal to x. Therefore, sin of sin inverse x. Sin of sin inverse x equal to x. Similarly, we can prove all other results. I want to prove one more result. I'll prove this third result. To prove tan of tan inverse x equals to x. First, I'll take tan inverse x equals to theta. Let tan inverse x equals to theta. From the definition of inverse tangent function, what we can write? We can write x is equals to tan theta. From the definition of inverse tangent function. If tan inverse x equals to theta, we can write x equals to tan theta. From this, x is equals to tan what is theta? You observe this first step. What is theta? Theta is tan inverse x. So in place of theta, you write tan inverse x. Now you observe that what is x? x is equals to tan of tan inverse x. What result we want to prove? The same result we got. Tan of tan inverse x equals to x. Therefore, tan of tan inverse x. Therefore, tan of tan inverse x equal to x. You observe one thing tan of tan inverse x equals to x. This results holds good when x is any real number. x is any real number. You observe here sin of sin inverse x equals to x. Sin of sin inverse x equals to x. This results holds good only when x belongs to closed interval minus 1 comma 1. This is very very useful result and very easy proof. Similarly, you please try remaining bits and you will get the solution easily. I hope you understand this class. If you like this video, please press like button below. Share this video with your friends. If you are not yet subscribed to my channel, please subscribe now. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.